know I post these so late all the time and I really don't have an excuse this week because I actually finished the book really early and I could have you know filmed this and even edited it like way beforehand so I have no excuse and I also didn't take notes while I was reading this week I really should have but I didn't and so that just make means that this is gonna be a really really short um, book review uh, this week the last book in the black magician trilogy the high lord um, you can tell by the past two uh, reviews I like this series it's a good series it's if you're into fantasy especially you know general plain old magic fantasy yay good it's good I like it um whereas last week I said it was um the theme for the novice was acceptance this week the high lord deals with morality and right versus wrong and it reminds me of a discussion on the Ning on the nerd fighter Ning that I had seen that was talking about um, morals and moral absolutism where you you know things are cut and dry this is good and this is bad no matter what or you know taking into account circumstances and times when things aren't necessarily bad which is the stance that I've always kind of taken that things depend upon the circumstances and and the high lord deals with this a lot you know when is something okay even if the cultural uh, even if normally the the culture assumes that that is wrong are there times when it's okay are there circumstances when it makes sense to do something that is generally considered wrong um, I of course won't use the book example because then I give it away um, in fact I saw someone on the nerd fighter thread ask murdering a child that shouldn't that at least be something that is always going to be wrong no matter what but then here's an example um, it's World War two and you're a Jew it doesn't have to be World War two I'm, I'm just it's just something though and you're hiding with a group of other people from the Nazis and you have a newborn baby who starts to cry and and won't be quiet and you basically have two options you either quiet the baby by covering its mouth and suffocating it or you let the baby cry and you let everybody who's in that closet or whatever hiding be found and everybody dies I mean it's not the baby's fault and people cringe when they think of killing a baby like under normal circumstances smothering a baby is not right at all but in this circumstance what would you do uh, both circumstances end with death but in one it's only one person who dies and in the other every single person who you're hiding with dies and you know I would argue that the one that you're gonna do is smother the baby and that's not necessarily a bad thing you know you're not a terrible person for saving the lives of all these other people 
it all depends. I don't believe that there's generally actions which... are absolute, that there is a definite right or wrong for every situation. And the High Lord has the same kind of thing. It, you know, for, especially for, you know, if you are into the idea that there is a definite right and wrong for everything, um, you know, it might kind of challenge that. When is something that is generally viewed as bad actually okay? Um, so, yes, I think that is the general theme for um, the third book, and I won't say more and give more away, but I liked the trilogy. It's, um, in its entirety, it's very awesome, and I think if you're into fantasy, you should check it out. If you're not into fantasy, maybe this would get you into fantasy. Um, it's pretty good. I like it. Um, let's see. I don't actually know what I'm doing for next week's book. Um, I made a thread on the Nerdfighter Ning, and I've asked for recommendations for fantasy, and I've got tons of responses. So I guess I'm going to go through there. I'm going to find which ones you know, I feel like doing, see which ones are currently at my local library, so don't, so I don't have to wait for them to ship it in, and, um, read and write a review, so I don't know what I'm doing right now, but, yeah, um, and stuff, and, um, I'll see you all next week, ta-ta!